Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Feeling young, but they treat me like the OG. And they want the tea on me, I swear these bitches nosy. Said he put some money on my head, I guess we gon' see. I won't put no money on this head, my niggas owe me. I got a. Good morning, guys, and welcome to my channel. For those of you on New Year, my name is Dimitri Noble. This is Dimitri Unfiltered. And for those of you who are already let's take a look, welcome back to my channel. I know it has been so long since you guys have seen me, but we're not gonna go there. We're just gonna focus on today. And today we will be having a day in the life vlog. Unfortunately, I am already running late because it's a public holiday. It's the 9th of August, which is Women's Month. If you're watching this in South African time and internationally, you know, I'm just <laughs> putting it out there. Yeah, it's a public holiday in South Africa. But with that being said, I planned on going to the gym this morning. Um, it's about 9 a.m. now. I'm currently running a little bit late because I snoozed and stuff. Um, yeah, I was supposed to be at the gym at 8, but you know, time and vlogging and everything. Yeah, but with that being said, welcome to a new vlog. Um... A new day, you know, uh, <laughs> I'm so nervous because I haven't vlogged in such a long time. But, you know, I just said, let me get up and vlog because me laying in bed the whole day is not going to do me any justice. So, with that being said, I'm on my way to the gym now. So, I'm going to go to the gym, get in some workout because I have started gymming like since two weeks back, which I always wanted to do. But I'll give you guys a live update about that. But today, yes, I'm going to the gym. I'm also going to get myself ready at the gym because um, later on I have to meet Lane. So I'm just thinking now, when I get back from the gym, I'm going now, so I'll probably get back from the gym about 10, 30, 11. So by the time I get home and I have to meet up with Lehane, it's not going to work out because we have to meet up at 2. We're just going for like a small um, quick date and whatever because we haven't done that in a while. So yeah, we're going to do that if time does allow us to. But so I decided like I'm going to the gym and I'm also going to get ready there as well in terms of shower there, shave my legs and do my skincare and everything. So when I get home, I could just get dressed because yeah, I decided to pack my gym bag and stuff like I just want to show you guys i literally have everything in this bag like this is not even my gym bag this is my work bag but i just said to myself because i'm also going to take my camera with hoping that they will allow me to gym you know just to show you guys like what i currently uh am doing my workout routine which is a small workout routine um i'm not doing anything major and stuff i'm just in my early beginning stage so my biggest thing right now is just getting myself to the gym every day so yeah but with that being said i'll give you guys an update but i just wanted to show you i have everything in this bag i have my shampoo my saving cream my hair um stuff like i have everything my skincare everything like i'm literally going to get ready there so i can just come home and then finish up do my makeup and whatever because time will definitely not be on my side as per usual but with that being said let me go welcome to a new vlog this vlog will definitely be a day in my life i'm not going to extend it for you guys and i hope you guys will enjoy it if you are new year i hope you guys will like and subscribe i was actually supposed to say that in the beginning of the vlog please guys like and subscribe don't skip the ads and thank you for being here and yeah I just hope you guys enjoy this vlog let me get going okay Ooh. That 
was so nice it was a little bit extra you know because I had to vlog in between so you know the shots and moving the camera and my tripod and everything but one thing I realized which I got a aha moment you know almost shed a tear or two is that I'm currently living in my vision board a few things for my vision board which I actually gave up or not gave up because you know how demotivated you get when you don't see your vision board coming to life but I think it's mainly because of the pressure we put on ourselves having to want to live in our vision board so oh sorry for my mouth guys so I just realized actually the first time i started gymming and if you guys can like backlog on my vlogs you would know i always talked about wanting to join the gym and also just like finding a gym that would fit my lifestyle in terms of me going to work and stuff because i'm a morning person so i like workouts in the morning and stuff here and there i will do like a afternoon workout maybe if i get from work and if i didn't if i didn't get a chance like to work out during the mornings time or whatever but with that being said that time already i realized that i'm currently living in my vision board but now when i brought my camera to the gym and i placed it there i said to myself like no but you actually are living in your vision board and there's also some other things as well me having this camera buying myself um a laptop and all that and other few things as well i realized that because my focus was not on my vision board anymore because my wallpaper on my phone like my screensaver was my vision board and whatever so I removed it and and sometimes randomly I'm just thinking going through my mind I'm like you're actually living in your vision board so my advice to you guys is sometimes just take your focus off like wanting to live in your vision board and just start living in it anonymously like don't even put pressure on yourself like oh I want to do this because this is my plans for the end whatever and I think we should just take away the time um, from our vision boards and just live in reality because some things like I have like 20 I have like 10 Oh, no, sorry eight to seven to ten things on my vision board that I wanted to accomplish and do this year but then I took the time away from it and I said to myself like if it doesn't happen this year some of the things I'm fine with happening in the following year or the year after that but currently now I'm just enjoying myself I'm finding my way back you know slow progress is better than no progress so yeah and we beat that procrastination this morning so I'm good honey I'm good because I said to myself like I'm tired let me not go and you see that was the devil that was literally the devil trying to disturb my mind and get negative thoughts in my mind you know but I beat at him and yeah so if I didn't came to gym right now I wouldn't have had this moment and I feel so good I feel so good that I made it here you know I'm just gonna get ready now as I told you guys I'm gonna take a shower because I laugh like I could go home and take a bath and get myself ready there but time is not on my side as I told you guys this morning but also having to shower because I don't have a shower at home you know we have a bath up so having to shower yeah while the that hotness that heat relaxes your muscles is the best thing always take a shower at gym after you finish guys if you don't have one at home so yeah let me get ready and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm gonna tell you this one time Oh my word, I love this song. Love it. Love this song. Like, I love it. Come on. Give me a good Give me a little. Give me. I've always looked for a song that I would love from the Beyonce album. I thought it's heated. You know, heated was my favorite. You know, I love this album. And I worked out on this song this morning. Like, this is my warm up song. I decided like that. And so. Move is just something. I saw it on tic, um, TikTok, yeah, a TikTok video from her tour, and I just loved it, you know, I loved it. You know, guys, if I could attend the Beyonce Renaissance tour, like, I would die. Like, my 
wish list of life would be complete like i've seen Nicki minaj now it's time for me to see beyonce like especially that tour. like i i don't know why they never bring their tours to south africa because they always say like a world tour honey but they'd be forgotten the african continent like where is it a world tour when you don't travel to africa you know but yeah i feel so good i'm so so hungry i think i'm gonna eat my porridge um my stepmother made oats this morning so yeah my skin is feeling so good like ah uh, i usually do like the whole skincare routine like two times a week on the weekends and uh, during the week on wednesday so i would usually do the whole garnia um skincare routine like two times a week during the rest of the week i use like the gentle magic and stuff um i'm still trying to find something to work for my hyperpigmentation and my acne but it's not something I'm stressing now. It's definitely something I'm considering changing into. But you know, these products that works for hyperpigmentation and acne cost so expensive. And honey, I don't have the money for that. Because it's one thing to buy a product. It's another thing to use it on a consistent basis. And to use a product on a consistent basis, you gotta have the money there for. Because you can't afford it for one month and the next month. You don't have the budget, you know, so yeah, but it feels so good. Let me quickly eat some porridge and yeah, then I'll see you guys when I'm on my way with Lehain. But my skin feels so, I feel so fresh. I feel so rejuvenated. I'm so happy that I decided to go to gym. I did plan to wake up and say to myself, I'm going to go to gym this morning due to the fact that it's a public holiday. So I will be able to do what I want to do, you know, the vlogging and everything in between. But also I procrastinated this morning as well because I eventually wanted to get up at seven. So I eventually got up at around eight. And once you're an hour late, then you're the schedule you decided to go for, honey, it's going like this so when you decide to do something at a certain time please do it don't postpone it don't lay especially when you're in bed laying and procrastinating and whatsoever like just go for it you know but yeah i'll see you guys welcome to my channel <laughs> hi guys i'm with my beastie my girl okay kim k come okay 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 doll okay yes honey yes Yes, uh, ooh, it's the shades for me. Who, who, who is it giving? Who is it giving? It's Balenciaga. Ooh, <laughs> an expensive girl, alien superstar. <laughs> whip, whip. <laughs> Since 2003, <laughs> you know, oh, just... <laughs> I'm with my friend, my bestie, for Women's Day. <laughs> you can chase I baby. I want to go steer it. I knew you were a cat. I'm a big guy. 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 I'm a big we are out here. <laughs> we are out here. <laughs> <like that. laughs> <laughs> I, I can't with this alien superstar, guys. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> you know. Oh. Okay, okay. You. Get it with that. Like, like, like. It was a PR drop. PR drop. Hey, what's the eight of I'm going to have If this is Kim Kardashian West, guys, which is down from the east, can you tell me I say, 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 I I say, I I say, I I I don't know how to do I'm 
Mama, I'm going to say that you're going to play. Hindi ka sa spectacle. Pai wanda play. Pai wanda. Trời ơi, nó sao? What are you having? The Say again. <laughs> it's giving. It's giving. Ooh. Mm. And that's how you eat other bitches' men. <laughs> Period. Period. <laughs>